What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another highly combustible reaction. We're jumping into the next one on our rose journey. Don't look back in anger, an Oasis live studio cover. You guys asked for it. I'm here with it. Always here for anything related to Blackpink, related to one of the Blackpink members. Like, absolutely. Their solo stuff is phenomenal. Shout out to all the blinks out there. Even my rose bias blinks. I love you. Let's jump in. Let's check it out together. Let's see what she did with this. Definitely a song where. I think everybody that listens to this song takes away something different. It makes it it, it it appeals and applies to them for different reasons, completely across the board. I think everybody pulls something different. There's no one set. Bam! Here's this is what this song is about. It's just kind of general. Let's jump in. Let's go for a journey. If you guys enjoy, get over show Rose all the love in the world. He definitely has a storyteller's voice through and through. I don't know, when she sings something, you believe her. One of the sweetest voices out there, for sure. I don't know. Rosé is one. Each one of them could be their own person, but I'm glad that they're a group. Like Craziness. Honestly, she could knock this song out, even a cappella, I think. Even without the guitar in the back, she would totally kill it. I would listen to her sing anything a cappella. Let's come on, hands down.
Song means something different to everybody that hears it. I swear to God, it's one of those songs. She definitely did a beautiful job. Honestly, I would like to put her like in the middle of a church, some big old room with amazing acoustics and just have her bailed out some acapella for us. Because that would be freaking fantastic. Get over the show. Rose, roses are rosy. Some love on her channel. Tell the next one of Miley Combustible. You guys be happy, healthy, safe. I love you to the moon and back, peace.